Germany's development minister has called for a diplomatic solution to the crisis in Niger. She says that the military coup has not only aggravated the development challenges that Niger is facing, but it's also destabilizing the entire region of West Africa. She's currently president of one of the region's most important donor communities, the Sahel Alliance, and has visited Mauritania to meet some of the people affected by the current turmoil. When she could no longer stand the violence and the war, when she was no longer allowed to cultivate her fields, she set out and fled from Mali to Mauritania. Here in the capital, she was registered by the UNHCR, the United Nations Refugee Agency. The young mother of four asked us not to broadcast her name. I am grateful to God every day that I am being helped here. Since registering, my life has improved. My children can go to school. We are taken care of if we get sick. Mauritania has taken in more than 100,000 refugees from neighboring Mali, a heavy burden for this country of only 4.6 million inhabitants. People here are worried about growing threats from terror, violence and hunger throughout the region. The coup by the military junta in Niger has sharpened those fears. The visit of Development Minister Schulze to Mauritania means demonstrative support for the only country still governed democratically among the core states of the Sahel zone. This is a very unstable region. It's always difficult to create statehood and stability here. That's what this government is trying to do, and we can only support them in doing so. The solutions have to come from the region. What we are doing is working in partnership in trying to stabilize this region. In many cases it works, but not always. Preventing a conflagration, that's the challenge. For the past few weeks, Svenja Schulze has been president of the most important group of international backers of the region, the Sahel Alliance. We have to keep making efforts to promote democracy, among other things. We can do that as donors by showing that the democratic states, the democratic structures are really helping the countries here in the Sahel. A visit to a fish market in Mauritania's capital, together with the Minister of Fisheries. The coastal fishing grounds here are among the richest in the world. Germany provides concrete support, cold storage systems and better hygienic conditions to protect the fish from spoiling quickly. Here too, a plea for peace after the coup in Niger. All Sahel countries, including Mauritania, want stability in Niger and in the Sahel. That is why we condemn this attempted coup. We appeal to the authorities in all Sahel countries to combine their efforts so that we can find a peaceful solution to this crisis through negotiation and not through violence. Without peace, there can be no solution to many other crises in this region, jihadist terror, climate change and the lack of prospects for the rapidly growing young population. Germany is focusing on giving concrete help on the ground. How difficult that can be is seen in Niger. All development aid from the Sahel Alliance there is currently frozen.